Hello everyone. And today our project is on uh, integrated solar drying system. So the purpose of this project is to create an environment that is uh, efficient for uh, seed storage. So here uh, on LCD display we are having a temperature in degree centigrade and humidity in terms of percentage displaying on here means uh, the environment that we created for seed storage is like this. So on top of this we have a CPU fan on uh, side of this another CPU fan. So the purpose of these two CPU fans is uh, one is for exerting of that moisture inside the room and one is for cooling the room when it crosses the limiting temperature which is not sufficient for uh, seeds. So here we are having a small solar panel which has been uh, used to get the solar energy and will be stored in this battery. So this is a 12 volts battery we are having here and the device entire device can be switched on by sliding this slide switch or you can say this as a toggle switch. Yeah fine. So here inside of this we are having a two relays one is here and one that is at the last to control the two CPU fans. And from battery we are having a, a power supply board which will convert the 12 volts to 5 volts which has been sufficient to all the components. And in the middle we are having an Arduino Uno microcontroller where the code is being dumped which gets the input from this DHT11 sensor that can be measured both temperature and humidity. So the environment that we created is like uh, the temperature should be below 25 degrees centigrade and humidity is like uh, 60 to 75 percentage. So when these two crosses its limit, two CPU fans will get turned on. So and only when temperature is being uh, greater than 25 and humidity is in uh, its threshold limit only, then only one CPU fan will be turned on. And the same will work with the second CPU fan. And when both temperature and humidity are in limit means both the CPU fans will be in off, on, I mean off state. So this is the THT11 sensor. By putting um, some temperature variation inside the room means uh, the value can be changed. So like that this entire system works. Thank you for listening.